Come on, man. You had to do that. You took my son from me. You took him from me. You snatched my soul. My soul is snatched. A 15-year-old becomes the latest victim in Akron's recent crime wave. Investigators say Tyron Phelps was one of three teens shot on Noah Avenue late last night. He and a 13-year-old were both rushed to the hospital where Tyron died. Police found out later that a 19-year-old was also shot. He was taken to the hospital. Tyron's mother says he was just hanging out with friends when he was killed. That was the second deadly shooting in Akron this weekend and the sixth murder since July 5th. Now city leaders are asking the community to stop the killing. Akron's police chief says recent attacks involving kids have reached new levels with more shots fired and more victims hit. That means increased patrols in neighborhoods where shootings happen and going after longer sentences for repeat violent offenders. But he says stopping the killings isn't just up to police. If you are a parent and your son has on his Facebook page a picture of him holding a firearm or if that 13 year old is throwing up gang signs, those are indicators that you are going to be in trouble, that that kid is going to be in trouble and we need to start addressing those issues. As for the shooting that killed that 15 year old, police don't have a motive or a suspect.